Good afternoon, this is Dr. Robert Cohen. We're here at uh, Heather Nicole Skincare, and today we're going to do a hip dip with sculpture. Now this young lady, if you look down here, has a bit of a little hip dip. You can see it from the side. Other than that, it's just normal when you get very well developed gluteal maximus and you get the anterior portion of the muscle developed, it creates a little hollowness here. So what she's trying to do is we want to fill this up so it needs more continuity, fills it up, makes it more round. So we do a little bit of a line. Is this, Sarah, is this what the area, am I getting the right area? Yeah. Okay. So Sarah, why don't you tell us what is it that you're looking for and what is it that's been bothering you? I'm just looking for a little more fullness right through here. Okay. And when you go from the back also. Okay. Yeah, I can see it more. A little bit of fullness there. So yeah. we're gonna, this is the area that we're going to inject. We're going to be using Sculpture today. Sculpture is a polylactic acid. Unlike other fillers, it will stimulate collagen production as an active component of it. Other fillers will stimulate it, but by the very nature of the body's foreign body reaction to stimulating collagen production. Sculpture actually will stimulate the collagen production. We use it quite often. People who want a large volumization of their face, um, I have a, a free clinic where we use it for HIV patients, and it's quite good for the hip flip, it, hip dip area because it'll give you a nice volumization, and it's going to be a, a natural volumization. So she'll see most of the growth after about a month or two, and it'll come up. And then if people need, they come back and get a second or a third treatment. So let's uh, numb her up, and we'll get going. Thank you. See how I'm going a little circles on the left, little circles on the left, little circles on the left? Mm -hmm. I want you to do that just for the next couple of days. Because what that does is it distributes the product and it sculpts it. So usually with sculpture, we're filming? Usually with sculpture, we call it the rule of five. Five times a day for five days for five minutes a day. But for the hip dip, you don't need to do it that much because you'll get the natural movement of your body dispersing the product. But see how that works? It got rid of the lumps and the bumps. And then it will start to stimulate collagen production. Give it a good 45 days. So as you can see, we built this up here, this area for her, the hip dip. Um, we went a little bit posterior for the glutei maximus a little bit. On the other side, can you turn around, Sarah? I'm sorry. So here, we did the same area and we went a little bit more projected back on Sarah on the left side. So massage it, massage it. How was the pain, Sarah? It wasn't bad. Okay. Good. So she should begin to see, and this stuff will come off. I'm gonna put a little arnica on you. That stuff will come off. Um, with, you know, water, when you go home, you can wash it with water.